really, nigga? Now, it's your boy, the Jackademics, man. Listen, man, sometimes I come across stories where the malarkey and the fucker just cannot be tolerated, and to be honest, makes me want to throw up before I even do it, and this is one of them, okay? Now, you hear about, and people always tell me this about Philly niggas, okay? Philly niggas are unlike any niggas in any urban city or community, okay? To be honest... Philadelphia is a city of brotherly love. Now, some niggas actually take that brotherly love shit to the next level. They get on that young thug, flexible nigga lifestyle, and they really go there. Now, there's a boxer, okay? His name is Yousaf Mack. Now, we're not talking about him for actually beating a nigga up. Well, maybe he beat a nigga off. Anyway, pretty much the reason why he's making the news, okay? A boxer, okay? A West Philly boxer. Basically, news came out or a videotape came out where he's in a porno. No! He's not doing an Adrian Broner donkey fucking two thotties and taping him doing it, okay? He's not doing a fake Ray J. What he's doing? I kid you not. I can't fucking make this up, okay? He's not fucking two thotties. He's fucking two niggas. Now, oh my god, I gotta take a break because I'm not, this type of malarkey I've never seen. Now, he swears he's actually straight. Now, this is the young thug, flexible nigga agenda coming to life at his finest because this guy maintains he is straight, but he's in a porno with two men and he's fucking him. Okay, now this is his explanation because people are saying, bruh, are you really saying it? By the way, I did not watch, so I don't know if he's getting penetrated or he's penetrating. Okay, if you niggas want to go look it up, God be with you. Okay, now. He is still maintaining that he is straight. Actually, he said the only reason why I did a porno with two niggas, okay? He said he was drunk. Somebody put a motherfucking Pill Cosby in his protein shake. Molly all in his goddamn shit. Now, this is just fuckery, okay? Now, he put out a couple of statements to kind of clear this up because this shit was so goddamn graphic and just so goddamn unusual. And to be honest, man, with everybody pushing like transgenders and listen, you could be straight one day, gay the next. Who knows, right? Now, he's in the video and there's some stills that's floating around. You, you guys even see that? Listen, he's passionately kissing niggas, okay? Passionately. Now, this is what he claims. He claims he swallowed a pill, which surprisingly, he probably swallowed more than a pill, okay? He probably su swallowed some dicks and all that type of shit, but he said he swallowed some pill that somebody gave him and washed it down with some vodka. Now, he says he doesn't know what the fuck happened, how the hell he even got to the place where the porno was shot. Yo, this is just kind of fuckery, okay? Listen, I'm reading this story, but this shit just sounds bizarre, okay? Now... He said sometime in June, he can't recall exactly, he said he boarded a train to New York City, he made his way to an address in the Bronx, once inside the apartment where the filming was taking places, he said he noticed it was a bunch of women, so he said he went there, that he thought he was going to do something with women, okay? Now, he said they gave him a pill and a shot of vodka. <laughs> oh my God, he said he got a pill and a shot of vodka, right? And he said the next thing he remembers is being on a train and somebody telling his ass to wake up, okay? Now, he didn't feel his anus hurting. He didn't feel the shit stains on his dick. I don't know what the fuck is going on with this guy, but Jesus Christ. Now, here's the crazy thing about it. Now, he wants to say, yo, listen, I'm married. I believe he has, like, a wife or fiancé. He also has a kid. And he says, yo, that is not me. And to be honest, man, when I was out of my mind, I did that bullshit, but I'm completely straight. Okay, now, he's not fooling nobody, okay? From people that did watch it, I did put up, like, the Instagram post about it, so some people did research it. They're saying he's really going in. Okay, so I don't personally believe you could be in a porno, a gay one, with two men. Okay, and then come back and say you're heterosexual. But people, as I said, they've told me that Philly niggas are unlike any niggas in the United States of America. Now, I, obviously, this doesn't mean the majority of Philly niggas, because I know a lot of Philly niggas, I don't think they get down with this flexible nigga lifestyle. But somebody from Philly got to step up. Do y'all know this motherfucker? We need answers. This shit is weird. Jesus Christ. Let's pray for Philadelphia because, God damn it, when they said the city of brotherly love, I didn't mean niggas were going to actually be fucking each other. This shit crazy. Bitch, Woody Jackademics, I'm out, man. This shit fucking crazy out of this bitch.